Hello and happy Tuesday to you all. I started off here because one, every time um, when every time I hit continue, Nagato starts to talk, and uh, I didn't want you guys to miss it. Like I felt like it would be mean if I made you guys miss it, but um, also because. I dabbled in this a little bit and I have fun. This is a, I guess a, like a magical, uh, cool game. I'm not gonna play it right now unless you guys want to see it, and then I'll definitely play it. But I, I saw it and it, po it popped up and I was like, oh, cool. Let me try. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day, and if not, I hope this makes your day a little better, or I hope it just makes you smile a little bit. So let's go ahead and hit continue. Because you know, for a long time, yes, humans have been taught that if you try hard enough, you can accomplish anything. See, this is why I said, but I'm, gonna, I'm gonna let him go ahead and finish this talking though. But this is what I meant by every time I started, I heard Nagato's voice. I hope that's Nagato and not some other creepy person, but yeah, even if we weren't told this directly, you'd know it just by looking at the world around us. The internet, TV, and newspapers are overflowing with hopeful messages that say exactly that. But people who can't win, people who don't try to win, people who try their best and still can't win, they are all worthless trash. Wow. Okay. Sorry, I'm scooting forward, you guys. There are two kinds of people in this world. Those who are born with worth, and everybody else. No matter how hard a lowly human tries, they will never be the same as someone who was born worthy. They say that effort breeds success, but that's a complete lie. The world is not that accommodating. No matter how hard a small dog tries, it will never become a large dog. I don't like how he's inching into the screen like this. It is creeping me out. No matter how much a penguin tries, there's no way it will ever soar through the sky. Which means unworthy humans will never become worthy, no matter what they do. People with talent don't become talented. They're just born with their abilities right from the start. And also, can we just acknowledge that the background is warped as hell? That's right. Just like you guys. That's why I have so much respect for you all. Uh, just so you know, what I feel is different from admiration. Admiration is wishing you could be like the object of your admiration. But what I feel is not so self-serving. How should I put it? What I feel is more pure. More like a selfless love that wants nothing in return. So, I want you guys to believe me when I say, I don't mind if you kill me. But if that happens, I want you to let me help. I don't care if the killer survives, or if everyone but the killer survives. I just want both sides to do their very best. Stop inching on the screen. I want to see with my own two eyes the absolute hope that lies ahead. Yep, I'm really lucky. Someone as insignificant as me will be there when hope and despair collide and unleash their energy. So please, let me help you. If you're planning to kill me, I would be honored to help you carry out your plan. He finally stopped inching, see? <laughs> but the background's still creepy. I want you to use me as a stepping stone so everyone can shine. I want you to kill me in a way that befits. Oh, shut up. Pow. Uh-oh. I don't know who that was that was talking that told him to shut up and bonked him. But, uh, okay, all right. See and punishment, sin and something else. I didn't see it. Biakia and Terra Terra died last night, just last night, excuse me. An ordeal like that, like that doesn't change the fact that I still get hungry. 
I learned that this <laughs> firsthand. <coughs> Sorry. I learned this firsthand as I headed towards the restaurant with Jerry and Sullen Footsteps. Hopefully everyone's here. Nope, we're missing a few people. I couldn't tell because the screen disappeared, but it looks like we're missing a few people. Ah, oh. uh, Hajime. You're already here. Good morning. Uh. Yo. Um, again, I cannot make Kazuichi's voice. I will try. But, uh, I don't- I cannot make Haj Kazuichi's voice either. Good morning. Yeah, it looks like there's a few people missing. Just as I thought, the atmosphere in the restaurant was pretty gloomy. After what happened yesterday... <gasps> Excuse me, I burped. I was drinking water. And it came right back up. I, I always have stomach issues. That was to be expected. Byakuya, who appointed himself our leader, was killed, and the person who killed him was our friend. And that friend was also killed right in front of us. After experiencing something like that, it's impossible not to feel sad. Huh? Huh? You guys don't look so good. Your faces all look like you attended two funerals in a row. <coughs> I forgot. Her voice is more like uh, this and annoying, but still, she's still annoying. I don't care. She could have the deepest voice and I would still hate her. I guess some people don't feel sad. Cause, cause that, like, that's like what happened. Byakuya and Terra Terra got killed. I'll go. I'm not talking to you, you ugly bitch. Wow. Keep it up. Keep it up. I'm telling you, somebody gonna get her. Ah. What? Why are you always so mean to me? But still, I don't under I understand about ham hands. But is there any reason for us to be sad about Terra Terra's death? Hey, hey! What the heck do you mean? Why? Well, he was a crazy guy who killed someone. He totally deserved to die. Hey. I understand how you feel, but you're going too far. That's weird. Huh? Is it all right to defend a killer? Are you trying to justify his murder? No, but you're being a little insensitive to people who are still terrified at the fact that this could happen. Although, I agree with Hyoko that we should not be like, oh my god, boohoo, Teru Teru, because he did something bad. We understand why he did it. He wanted to see his mommy. But it's not okay. It's never okay to do something bad just because you want to see your mommy. <laughs> I want to see my mommy too. I'm not going to off somebody. No. No, that's not my intentions, but... Hey! Then you gotta hate him more than ever. You gotta hate him from the bottom of your heart. He's a stupid piece of trash bastard who committed the lowest crime possible. He deserves to get killed. In fact, I'm rather relieved that he was executed. If I could have, I would have spat on him too. Uh-oh. Hmm... Hey, what gives? Do a pea brain like you have something to complain about? It's not like that. Well, it's not about that, but it smells. Something smells, don't you think? Huh? <gasps> Again. It can't be. Don't tell me. It better not be another dead body. Hmm. Nah. It's not that it smells like blood this time. It just smells really bad. It smells bad? Um. It's kind of like a bar or nightclub smells after closing time, you see? Hey, hey, hey. I don't know those smells. You must have had a pretty rough life. Now that you mentioned it. Now that you mentioned it? Oh, <clears throat> wrong person. I was reading, I'm about to read it in Mahara's voice and I got mixed up. Now that you mentioned it, I do smell something. It's like a sewer or rotten garbage. I know what it is. Nekumaro's breath probably stinks. <laughs> you got me there. She didn't say anything remotely funny just now, huh? Mm. No, it's not Nekumaro. Smells coming from... 
You, Hyoko. Uh oh. Whoa, Whoa it's true. Hyoko, you reek. Did you do it to me? <laughs> a rotten smell stings my eyes. As if a demonic eclipse is about to commence. Oh god. <laughs> so you ha you're popping off at the mouth, young lady. And all this time, let me fix this real quick. All this time you walk around here with funk booty. Don't ever speak on somebody. Ow. Oh, <laughs> I can't believe you. <laughs> cry all you want. You know what? She can cry all she want. Funk booty. <laughs> Oh, she's crying. Hey. I've said this before. You guys are really insensitive. That was close. Oh, no. It actually doesn't smell that bad. I mean, as long as I breathe with my mouth. <laughs> You're not helping, Kazuichi. Be quiet. Like, are you taking? Are you even taking baths? Oh God, no. You having bathed? I, I can't help it. I can't tie my Komodo sash by myself. <laughs> Poor little dirty buns. Oh, the, the itty bitty stinky buns. <laughs> can't tie the Komodo sash by herself. Hey. Hey, Hyoko. Don't cry. You don't have to cry so much. I'll tie the sash for you, okay? <laughs> no. <laughs> really? <laughs> I can only tie a simple knot, but if that's okay with you, I'll teach you. Oh, at least she's happy again, I guess. I love you, Maharu. I'll give you a kiss. Hey, Hyoko. You don't have to hug me. Yeah, nobody wants them. Filthy, oily, greasy, stanky hand, green, like fog coming off of her hands and face and stuff. Nobody wants that on them. It appears you cannot escape. It appears you have. To, she has taken a liking to you. <laughs> Welcome to the world of girl love. It's slippery when wet. <sighs> She's that friend that you take to the store, right? And then she says something embarrassing, so you gotta grab her arm and be like, okay, let's, come on. <laughs> We're gonna go now. The air is suddenly not as tense anymore. Well, I guess it's better than being down forever. If I was all by myself, I probably wouldn't have been able to put my feelings aside and move on like this. I guess I have these guys to thank. Uh-oh, I got a burp. Oh God, that wasn't burp. Ugh. I'm sorry, you guys. I have stomach issues. Um. Anyways, what happened to Fuyuhiko and Nagato? It seems they are both not here. Uh. Now that you mention it, you're right. I saw Fuyuhiko earlier near the hotel, I invited him to breakfast, but he declined. Hmm. Well. That's just Fuyuhiko being Fuyuhiko, but huh? who cares about Nagato? <laughs> he is cursed. A child who summons misfortune, so to speak. Well, that may be, but... Just letting you know, I don't know anything. I have no idea. Without hesitation, I don't know anything about Nagato at all. Right. He's right. Forget about him. <laughs> Let's just forget about that creep already. Uh-oh. Huh? They're obviously acting suspicious, aren't they? Of course not. I'm not suspicious. Impossible. Hmm, that's right. I'm not suspicious. What's the matter? What's up? Did someone get kidnapped or something? Is he telling on them? Is, is, did he just tell? Did y'all kidnap Nagato? Don't... <laughs> I mean, I get it, y'all hate him, but come on. You came just at the right time. Hmm? hmm. At the right time? No. Uh, it, it's nothing. I don't really get it, but you must have yearned for me. 
Your outlook on life has changed due to the cuteness, so your body can't stand to live without me, huh? I can't help myself, you know? My body reacts to Monokuma on its own. No. Something like that? Stupid. Who cares about that? Just hurry up and tell us why you're here. Actually. To be honest, I'm searching too. My vowed ser valued servant has disappeared. Monomi? Servant? What the hell? You know, my mono beast. One of them just disappeared. Huh? One of the mono beasts disappeared? Hmm. Maybe I cut back on the cost of their food too much? Perhaps they're boycotting me. Let me tell you. This. But that guy with the weakest. Uh, uh, sorry. Sorry, I messed up. Rewind. But. That guy is the weakest of the League of Four. How shameful for the Mono Beast to lose to a mere human. <laughs> That's what you want to say, right? Uh oh. Don't, please don't upset Monokuma. We see what happens when you upset Monokuma. Nature, the collective will of the world. <laughs> Though this is merely the, pre the prelude, the climax will occur soon after. Now then, <laughs> screaming through me off. <laughs> Sorry. Now then, let me hear you scream. I shall make such sweet music for you. <laughs> I could keep a straight face. <laughs> Please do not make Monokuma angry. Yeah, yeah. Hey Gundam, you should stop playing with that stuffed animal. I'm still being called a stuffed animal. Well, looks like you guys don't really know anything about the mono beats either. Then it was a waste of time to wor <laughs> for me to worry about it. I don't want to go bald for worrying so much. Okay. A wise cat bot once said, our eyes are on the front so we can keep moving forward. What does that mean? What? I'm so confused. <laughs> As Monokuma said those familiar sounding words to us, once again, he disappeared. Familiar. Did someone in this group say it? Or is it from last game? Or something in between that I missed? <laughs> Cause I'm lost. No way. Hey, what do you think he meant just now? <clears throat> Excuse me. He said something about the mono beast disappearing? Mm. Hmm. The only possibility I can think of is... Um, um, were you in the middle of something? If so, I can come back later. What did you do, Monomi? Then leave. Yeah, yeah. you <laughs> at least ask me a <laughs> to leave kindly. Hey, hey. Uh, before you leave, I want to ask you something. Did you have anything to do with the disappearing Monobies? Ah, yes. That's right. I am the one who defeated the Mono Beast. You did? You serious? Defeating a monster like that? How the hell did someone like you pull that off? <laughs> I'll talk about that more in detail in a different mode. Anyways, I've released a bridge gate for you all. I think I know she's talking, she's talking about that game mode that just popped up. I uh, played a little bit of it. I didn't play a lot of it and I actually died to the Mono Beast. But um, anyway, we're, we're not going to talk about that. <laughs> we're just going to keep breezing by. Like, I just didn't tell you guys that I got off on the first level. <laughs> Anyways. Hey, hey. If the gate is open, that means we can go to the new island across the bridge, right? Is that true? <laughs> uh -huh. That's totally right. Now that you all can go, uh, can go to more areas... Let's all get along and live a fun life together for sure this time. Love, love. Love, love. Um, living together is... <coughs> oh, God. <coughs> I almost mixed Monomi's voice. Living together is on this island isn't what's important. We need to find a way to escape. Please. Of course. Escaping from this island was our main goal. Huh? Uh-oh. Nobody wants to live on a swashbuckling Hollywood type action film. What? <laughs> mm, 
I want to live a life where I can be more average. A life where nothing happens. That's better for me. Alright. Alright. If you find anything that can be salvaged for boat parts, just let me know. It seems everyone it seems everyone's united on a path that's different from what I had planned. Now then, let us begin. <laughs> His screaming always throw me off. Then let's disperse. Time has come to release this cursed seal. All right. All right. <laughs> let's find a way to leave this island. That is impossible. Hmm. Huh? Leaving this island is no longer possible. No longer possible. Hey, what is that? Huh? Hey, hey. Hey, Hajime, just leave that thing alone already. After all, she's the same as Monokuma. It's better if we don't get close to her. You're right. Uh-oh. When Chiaki looks at me like that, I just know that it's... It's just gotta be bad. Like, I think that we made a mistake. Like, she's not like Monokuma at all. It seems everyone's attention has shifted towards exploring the new island. Expecting to find something that will help us escape from the situation, everyone filed out of the restaurant. Except for Funk Nasty over there. And her. So I guess they're going to stay back and she's going to shower. Bathing is more important than New Island. They'll tease me for being stinky. Yeah, we will. Because the way you've been talking to people since you got here, I'll tease you. A new island, huh? I should go find some clues. Sorry, I was gonna sneeze. I should go find some clues too. Eh, uh, you can't. You promised to tie my Komodo sash. Hey. That was. We can do that after we finish exploring a new island. Ow, 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 ow. I hit my elbow. I hit my elbow. Oh, it hurt. It hurt. It hurt. <laughs> but. If I don't hurry and go take a bath, they'll call me smelly again. They're gonna bully me. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Then let's take a light shower first. Yay! Yay, we're gonna wash each other. Huh? Huh? Wash each other? Hey. Hold on. I don't think it's a good idea for me to go in too. <laughs> now, now, we're both girls. There's no need to be shy. But let's go. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Hyoko pulled Miharo's hand, <laughs> smiling like a child before a school trip and heading towards the cottage. Okay. Wash each other. I see. Wash each other, huh? Okay, so let's check our uh our poopsie kittles. How are you doing, poopsies? I guess you're not doing I mean you're doing okay. And then let's look at the map. So it doesn't look like, oh, uh, this is so sad. Wonder can we go in there? Might go there. So it doesn't look like there's anybody over here. And I hope the game wasn't telling me to go and look at them in the shower either. But I guess we can go out, right? Can we go in this building yet? I mean, can we go in the building? We need to do our best to make sure that, oh yeah. yeah. Okay, okay, okay. So. I guess we're off to the central island. If, um, game, come on. This, I, I'm telling y'all, I hate the gamepad. It's good, so it has its ups and downs. It's the same with the keyboard and the mouse. It has its ups and downs. But, um, I forgot what the run button was. But it's it's good and it's bad at the same time. Can we go in the market yet? I got some points. Okay, okay, okay. So. But, yeah, it's, it's good for certain things in this game. But it's also terrible. When I say it's terrible, I mean, you guys see how I be walking. It is. It is just awful. Can we go to the beach? 
You're going to make this really hard for me. So I think we go to the Central And this is door one, so we get to head to door two. Am I going the right way? Am I going the right way? I don't know. I, th I think it's going to loop around and go to five. Right? No, two. Here it is. She's right. The mono beast that was blocking this bridge is gone. Plus, the gate that was blocking this bridge is now open. I guess mono me was right after all. <sighs> the laws behind this bridge. All right. I guess I should find out. Oh, this sucks because Biakia should have been here with. So this is the new island. Uh oh. The ambiance seems different compared to the first island with the hotel. It definitely does. It also looks different too. Like there looks to be waterfalls and stuff. It's kind of crazy. Well, now's not the time to make carefree observations. There might be a clue here if it, that tells us how to leave this island. I can find. I need to find it. Excuse me. I can find it. Jesus. So let's look at the map real quick, and then we'll probably stop it right there. I have a hundred and four coins. I wonder what happened if I had got an A. Jesus, so I think that's just telling me. Oh, no, that's telling me that that's a uh, 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 Gundam So there's the ancient ruins uh, Bridge to the central island. So this is where we came from uh, da, 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 skipping ahead There's a library where uh, Oh my god, I forgot her name Sonia <laughs> And the and Peku Peku is at Uh of course, um, oh my God, I'm forgetting names today. Our beautiful nurse is here. Our beautiful, shy, timid nurse is here. I'm gonna watch it, her name jumps in my head after a while. Um, looks like no one's here, but this is a diner in the diner parking. So I guess we'll go check that out too. Especially because it's a diner here, which is weird. There's a shower room, a closet, a beach house where Kazuichi is and Ibuki, Nekumaru, and Akane is at the other beach. So there's another beach, or maybe the beach is connect. Oh my god, I am going to lose it if I don't remember her name. Okay, I just takes it back there. So when we come back to this, we're going to explore all of this, every little bit of this. But. As I check the pet, I'm going to tell you guys, thank you so much. Ah, you poopsie poops, you double poops. I, ew, stinky, stinky. We wash your butt though. We don't want you smelling like Hyoko. Thank you guys so much. I hope you guys have a fantastic day. And if not, I hope this made your day a little better. Please, wash your buns. Don't be walking around with cold, smelly cheeks, please. If you can, you know. Um, some people don't have access to a shower, so if you can, thank you so much. And I, and I will see all of you guys in the next video. Bye and have a great day.